Hello guys, welcome to Minano Nihongo Lesson 1. In this class grammar, in this video, we'll be learning the grammar, vocabulary, and the English translation for lesson 1. We will also be bringing you two bonus clips. The first bonus clip is the languages used in our classroom and our everyday greetings. And the second bonus clip is how do you pronounce the countries, the people, and their languages in Japanese language. For some of you, perhaps this is your very first grammar slide for a uh, Japanese language. Before you learn this grammar, be sure to learn the Japanese writings of hiragana and katakana. There are also uh, kanji and romaji in Japanese writings. Uh, hiragana and katakana is the two basic uh, sound uh, sound syllables that you have to at least understand and learn by heart before you can understand the the readings in the books, right? So be sure to learn the hiragana. Just a slight history of Japanese uh, language, just for your interest. Hiragana and katakana was first invented in the 9th century. Well, kanji is originated from China from the word Han Zi and Han meaning the Chinese people and Zi means words so Chinese people's words so it's a Ganji okay? and as of today in Japan there are around 2,000 Ganji words used while in China people are learning up to 5,000 Chinese characters also uh, there's a little snapshot about the history of Japanese writing. I hope all of you are excited to learn the Japanese language. Well, without further ado, let's begin with the first grammar. The first grammar that we're learning for this lesson is the particle wa. Particle wa is, if you change it to an English translation, it simply is the M, is and R in a sentence, you know? So I am Mike Miller. He is a teacher or she is or something. So M, is, R, the English, the, the Japanese particle for M, is, R is wa. Okay? We'll be looking at some examples how do we use wa in a sentence, all right? And then the second grammar we'll be learning is how do we convert the sentence into a negative statement by adding ja arimasen at the end of the sentence, alright? The third grammar we'll be learning is how do we turn a sentence into a question by adding the particle ga at the end, okay? And then the fourth grammar is how do we indicate that something is also something, you know? So we simply replace the wa with mo and the second sentence, all right? And then uh, the fifth grammar we learning is the noun modifier no. No is a noun modifier that indicates something belongs to something, right? And then the last grammar is introducing the word sun, okay? Sun is normally uh, appears at the end of the person's name at the end of the person's name to indicate respect like mister and miss you know um, normally we don't we don't introduce our family member as mister you know you would more likely to say that this is my father it's not it's not mister something right but uh, mister and miss in english in in, in in Japanese, it's actually just sun, right? So later we'll be looking at some examples how to use the word sun. Continue on, be doing some English translation for the Reibun and Kaiwa. Reibun are examples and Kaiwa are conversations on page 6 and 7, right? The next, we're going to be learning 39 new words, vocabulary, and Followed by the two bonus clips. Okay, the first grammar, wa. This is a particle, wa, here. As you can see, there's first noun and the second noun, and then followed by this. So, this is the very, very basic Japanese stru sentence structure. Mm, this is 
to indicate while here is to indicate that the subject is what over here right so let's look at one example i am mike miller watashi wa maiku miller desu okay so in english is i am mike miller okay uh, if we say she is a teacher he is a police officer we're gonna say kanojo wa kyoshi desu kari wa keisatsu kan desu right so i think that this is very simple but to make sure that um the first noun and the second noun is a noun okay it cannot be a different thing it cannot be watashi and then adjectives here no it has to be two nouns here right so uh the next grammar we'll be learning is how do we turn the sentence into a negative statement right So we simply add a ja arimasen at the end. So for example, over here is I am Mike Miller. Watashi wa Mike Miller desu. If I want to turn this into a negative statement, I'm going to say I am not Mike Miller. Watashi wa Mike Miller ja arimasen. Okay? When we say ja arimasen, the desu is removed. Right? So she is not a teacher. He is not a police officer. Kanojo wa... Kyoshi ja arimasen. Kare wa keisatsu kan ja arimasen. Okay? Sometimes we can also use de wa arimasen. It's more polite than ja arimasen. So, for example, Mr. Santos is not a student. So, we can say Santosu san wa de wa gatsei de wa arimasen. So, Over here, you can see noun one and noun two is still here, and the particle wa is still here. You simply add ja arimasen or de wa arimasen at the end of the sentence to convert it into a negative statement. The next grammar we'll be learning is how do we turn a sentence into a question? Is Mr. Miller an American? Mira san wa America jin desu ka? In this sentence, what we have to be careful about is the second noun. The second noun have to be a noun, okay? We cannot simply say Mira san wa America desu ka? You know, it will be different because Mira san is a person and America is a country. So you have to turn this America into America jin, jin into a person, American person. So is, Amer- is Mira American person? You know, so Mira san wa America jin desu ka? Alright. The second example is we can ask who is that person? That person is ano hito. Ano hito wa donata desu ka? Or ano to ano hito wa dare desu ka? Okay. Donata is the polite version of dare. Okay. If you want to ask what is that, okay, we'll be learning that in the second lesson after this first lesson. But for this first lesson, we're just gonna learn who is that person, okay? What is that thing? We're gonna learn that in our next lesson, right? Okay. Okay, the next particle is more. More is to indicate something is also something, right? More is placed on the second sentence. Uh, the second characters that is also the same applies for the first person. So the same person with the two qualities, right? So for example, Mr. Miller is a company employee. Mr. Santos is also a company employee. So we get that Mira san wa kaishain desu. Santos Santo-san wa kaisen desu. We can say that, right? But instead of that, we can say Santo-san mo kaisen desu. So the wa is removed and replaced by mo. By using mo, we kind of uh, helping us to understand that okay, they are both companies and bodies. Okay, there are two. They are the same characters. Both of them 
have the same character. That is, both of them are company employees. So more is a way to explain something is also something. Right? Now the next particle we learning is no. No is a noun modifier. Uh, it can change the the first noun into a you know, it can change. Um, it can it can tells you something about something. So it can tells you something belongs to something. So in this case, it's IMC no kaishan des. IMC employee. So IMC no kaishan des. So Mr. Miller is an IMC employee. So he say Mira san wa IMC no kaishan des. Okay. And the next. Uh, grammar villainy is son. Okay, son is added to the given name or family name of the listener to show the speaker's respect to that person. We should never use son on our own name, right? And normally for young children, we add the word chan, okay, next to the name. So I hope this is very clear for all of you, and let's look at some examples. Some sentence pattern that we can see on page six here. Okay, Watashi wa Michael Miller des. I am Mike Miller. Santoso san wa gakusei ja arimasen. Mr. Santoso is not a student. Right? Sentence examples: Ray Boon. Are you Mr. Miller? Are you Mr. Mike Miller? Anata wa, anata wa Mike Miller san desu ka? Hai, watashi wa Mike Miller desu. Hai, yes, I am Mike Miller. Are you a student, Mr. Miller? Miller san wa gakusei desu ka? Iye, watashi wa gakusei ja arimasen. Hai shan desu. I'm not a student, a company employee. Wan san wa a engineer desu ka? Is Mr. Wan an engineer? Iye, Wan san wa engineer ja arimasen. Isha desu. Ano kata wa donata desu ka? O ano hito ano kata wa dari desu ka? O ano hito wa dari desu ka? It can all be used, you know, it means the same thing. And then the answer is Wato san des. Sakura daigaku no sensei des. So, uh, is Mr. Watt? He is a professor. He is a teacher of Sakura University. So notice here, Sakura University no sensei. Yes. So he is the teacher of Sakura University. So put the Sakura University at the front and no sensei des, because this is indicating that he is a teacher of Sakura University. Right? How old is Teresa? Teresa Chan wa nan sai desu ka? So over here, this is a question. So put a ka at the end of the sentence, and nan sai is something like um, uh, how old? Okay, nan sai desu ka? And that says you sai desu nine years old. Next, we're gonna do an English translation for the kaiwa on page seven. Page seven is a conversation between Mr. Santos, Yamada-san, and Mirasa. Okay. Uh, if you look at the photograph, there is a person in glasses. Uh, he is Yamada, and the person in 
the the foreigner is uh, Mike Miller and the lady is Satosan. Okay, let's begin the conversation. Satosan. Good morning. Ohayo gozaimasu. And Yamada sa Yamada san say Ohayo gozaimasu. Sato san. Kuchira wa Mike Mira san desu. Good morning, Miss Sato. This is Mike Miller. And then Miller Mike Miller said, Hajimiste, how do you do? Mike Mira des. I am Mike Miller. America kara kimasta. I'm from America. Dojo yoroshiku. Please to meet you. And then Sato san replied, Sato Keiko des. I am Keiko Sato. Dojo yoroshiku. Nice to meet you. Right. In the next section, we'll be learning the vocabulary. Uh, I'm just gonna quickly run through. There are a lot of vocabs here. So, watashi is I, and then anata is you, and anohito or anokata is means that person, he or she. And then san is, as we have mentioned before, this is a suffix for Mr. and Miss added to a name. And chan is a suffix added to a child's name. And Teresa chan. Alright? And then the suffix for a national of, you know, is added a jin. So, America jin. Okay? Teacher and instructor is sensei. And teacher and instructor is also called kyoshi. Mm, student is gakusei. 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 And company employee is Kaishain Des Kaishain. And employee of a company is Shine. Okay, so Kai here is actually a company. Employee is Shine. Bank employee is Ginko in. Okay, Ginko as you men as you can see here, Ginko is a bank and in is the employee. Medical doctor is Isha. And researcher or scholar is Ken Kyusha. Okay. University is Daigaku. Hospital is Byuin. Who is Dare or Donata? Years old is Sai. If you want to indicate the age, we can put a number there and then add a Sai at the end. How old is Nan Sai? And height is yes and Ie is no. Hajimimaste, how do you do? Kara kimasta. I'm from. Okay, and then we put a place noun here. Kara kimasta. Place and kara kimasta. Pleased to meet you. Dojo yoroshiku. Onegai shimasu. Yoroshiku is a very common word for nice to meet you. Or hajimimaste. It's also, it's also nice to meet you. Okay? Shitsurei desu. Excuse me, this is normally used for when you are leaving the room or when you are asking someone for personal information. Excuse me, shitsurei desu. And then, may I have your name? Onegai, onaimai wa? Onamai wa? Or we can ask, onamai wa nan desu ka? What is your name? Or what's your name? Onamai wa? This is Mr. or Miss. Kochira wa de 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 san desu. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna introduce you with some countries' name in Japanese. Like USA, America is actually America, and UK is Igirisu. India is Indo. South Korea is Tankoku. Thailand is Thai. China is Chugoku. Indonesia is Indonesia. Germany is Dutsu, Japan is Nihon, Brazil is Burajiru, Italy is Italia, Egypt is Engineer, Egypt is Egypto, e Egypto, Australia is Australia, Saudi Arabia is Sawa. 
Saudi Arabia. Philippines is Philippine. Philippine. Singapore is Singapore. Malaysia is Malaysia. Spain is Spain. France is France. Vietnam is Vietnam. Mexico is Mexico. Russia is Russia. Russia. Okay, let's look at the bonus clip. Uh, this is the common sentences used in a classroom. Let's begin. Hajime masho. Let's finish. Owari masho. Let's take a break. Yasumi masho. Do you understand? Wakarimasu ka? Yes, I do. Hai, wakarimasu. No, I don't. Ie, wakarimasen. Once more, please. Mo ichido. Onegaishimasu. Please is onegaishimasu. Okay? That's fine. Ii desu. No, that's wrong. Chigaimasu. Name onamai. Pass on homework is... Shiken is pass. And sukudai is homework. Shukudai is the homework. And shiken is a pass. Okay? Question, answer, and example. So, shitsumon is question. Korai, kotai is an answer, and rei is a answer. Everyday greetings include good morning, ohayo gojaimasu, hello is konnichiwa, good evening is konbawa, good night is oyasumi nasai, goodbye is Sayonara. Thank you is Arigato gozaimasu. Excuse me or sorry is Sumimasen. Please is Onegai Shimas. Okay. The next bonus clip is introducing the countries, people, and languages. Uh, there's a very similar pat pattern when you are introducing the country's person. We simply add Jin at the end of the country name, so America Jin. Okay, for the languages of that country, we simply add a Go at the end of the country's name, so America, America Jin, America Go. Okay, American language, American. So country starting with uh, USA, America, America Jin, America Go. Now, uh, American language, we can say America go or we, uh, because American use English, so we can say A go. A go is English, right? So, Igirisu UK, Igirisu Jin, A go is the language. And Itari, yeah, Italia, Italia Jin, Italia go. Okay. Iran is Iran, Iran Jin. Iran people actually speak the Persian language, so Perusia go. India is Indo, Indojin. In the Indian people use the language Hindi, which is in in hiragana is in katakana is Hindi go. Okay, and Indonesia is Indonesia, Indonesia Jin, Indonesia go. Okay, Egypt is Ajibuto Ajibuto Jin Ajibuto Go that's Arabic okay Osu Toraria Australia Osu Toraria Jin Australian and Ego Taiwa Canada Canada Jin Canadian also use the English words so their language is Ego and Korea is Kankoku, Kankoku Jin, Kankoku Go. Saudi Arabia is Saudi Arabia. And Saudi Arabia Jin, Saudi Sa Arabia Go is the Arabic language. Right? Singapore is Singapore. 
Singaporean and Singaporean is also using the English word so ego. Spain is Supain, Supainjin, Supango, Thailand is Tai, Taiji, Taigo, and China is Chugoku, Chugokujin, Chugokugo, Germany is Deutsu, Deutsu Jin, Deutsu Go, Japan is Nihon, Nihonjin, and Nihongo, France is Furansu, Furansu Jin, Furansu Go, and Philippines is Philippine Jin, Philippine Go, Brazil is Burajiru, Burajiru Go, Burajiru Jin, Burajiru Go, Vietnam is Botanamu, Botanamu Jin, Botanamu, Bot, Betonamu Go, Malaysia, Malaysia Jin, Malaysia Go, Mexico, Mexico Jin, Mexico Go, Spain, Spain and and Russia is actually. Russia and Russia Jin, Russia Go. Well, we have come to the end of lesson one. Thank you for watching until the end. Please subscribe to our channel with Milan Academy for more videos.